Many people know about the benefits of meditation, but the problem is how to put it into practice on a consistent basis. There are a few common objections why people don't meditate on a consistent basis, although they know how to meditate. First, they say, I don't have time. Second, the mind gets easily distracted or I fall asleep when I meditate. Number three, meditation is difficult. And number four, I don't seem to get anything from meditation. Now, as far as uh, time is concerned, I'm going to introduce a method on how we can meditate in five minutes. Just five minutes is enough for a complete meditation. Second is I fall asleep or my mind gets distracted. So I'm going to introduce a device. And in this device, it will help you to anchor your attention on your meditation. Third is meditation is difficult. Yes, it might be difficult because very often people make use of the breath as the object of meditation. You see, the mind is fairly gross when we sit down to meditate because the mind runs all over the place. And when we try to watch the breath that is subtle, it is difficult for a gross mind to be able to catch the subtle breath. So it is like um, trying to hold grains of very fine sand in your palms and you find that the sand starts coming out from, you know, from your fingers. So uh, this technique that I'm going to introduce will uh, uh, be able to create a more uh, a clearer object for meditation. And finally, if we begin to meditate on a consistent basis, then we will get the direct benefits from meditation and that is feeling more happy and more happiness and more joy. All right, now what is meditation? Meditation is actually a technique of cultivating the mind. It is to culture the mind so that the mind, the mental energies are focused, are being brought together in one, uh, into a single point. And our mind becomes very steady, very stable, without mental distraction. And it also brings about um, very wholesome states of the mind when we meditate. Now, um, mindfulness is part of meditation. And John Kabat-Zinn, who started a program called Mindfulness Stress Reduction Method, uh, defines mindfulness as the awareness that arises from paying attention on purpose in the present moment, non-judgmentally. In other words, in meditation, we uh, must intentionally bring the mind to an object of meditation. And it must be in the present moment and without passing judgment of likes or dislike. And we observe phenomena as it arises from moment to moment. There are five components in this meditation expresso, which I'd like to introduce to you. And uh, first, I will introduce each of the techniques, and then we shall put them together in a five minutes meditation. All right, the very first technique is what I call a thumb stroke technique. Uh, the way to do this is to put your right palms over your left palm with the thumbs touching together. And as you begin to stroke your thumb, if you could see this, the stroking of the thumb, you get some sensation from your thumb. Now, the sensation from your fingers are very clear, uh, certainly much clearer than the sensation from the breath. All right? So as you stroke your thumb, try to be with that sensation right through, right throughout. All right? So just observing the sensations as it arises, and then you brush your thumb backwards and be aware of the sensation throughout without any break. You can do that, you think? We try that for one minute. I will start now.
Very good. So that is one minute of watching the sensation. How is it? How many percent do you think that you were with this sensation? 20%? 50%? 80%? Or you're throughout uh, with the sensation on your fingers? So that is the first step. In the second step, we observe our breath, we become conscious of our breathing in and breathing out, and we synchronize the stroking of the thumb with the breathing in and breathing out. As you breathe in, you stroke your thumb in one direction, and as you breathe out, you stroke your thumb in the other direction. Um, just pay attention to the sensations arising from your thumbs first. Right? So it is the thumb acts like an anchor or it acts to amplify the movements of your breath. So just pay attention to your fingers first, but later on as you begin to, uh, more and more with this practice, then you can shift your attention to the breath. All right. So we're going to do this for one minute. Are you ready? Synchronizing the movement of your thumb with your breathing in and breathing out. Alright, now. now we shall move on to the practice of loving kindness. We send love and kindness in our practice. And the very first uh, practice is to send loving kindness to different parts of your body. Now our body is composed of cells and I was told that there are 37 trillion cells in the body. Can you, um, of course the number of cells will vary based on our body size but we have billions and billions of cells and all these cells respond to our mind, to our thoughts. All right? So if we have good, happy thoughts, all the cells in our body will respond to the thoughts. And you can clearly understand that if the mind were to be separated from the body, what will happen to the cells? All right? So we will send a, a happiness or we will smile to different parts of the body. What do you associate with a smile? Happiness and uh, kindness, uh, uh, joy, all right? So we will do this for one minute, if you're ready. Gently close your eyes. Uh, just be aware of your eyes. And put a smile in your eyes. And be aware of your forehead. Let your forehead smile. Let your cheek smile. Let your throat smile. Now be aware of your upper part of the body. Let the upper part of your body smile. Your lungs, your heart, your liver, your spleen, your kidneys, your stomach, and in your intestines, and to the lower part of your body. Let the lower part of your body smile. Now your entire body is smiling right now. Now we will direct thoughts of loving kindness first to ourselves. And the purpose is to fill ourselves with love and light. And the wish is, may my heart be peaceful and free. May my heart be peaceful and free. And we will send this wish for one minute.
May my heart be peaceful and free. May my heart be peaceful and free. Listen to your heart after you make the wish. May my heart be peaceful and free. And for the fifth step of Meditation Expresso, we will send these wishes of kindness and love to a friend. A friend whom we are really fond of, but maybe not someone whom we are too emotionally attached to or romantically attached to. Think of a friend that each time when you think about him or her, it brings happiness to your heart. And you think of this friend with a smile on your face, thinking about the friend's good quality and say, my friend, may your heart be peaceful and free. We will do that for one minute. My friend, may your heart be peaceful and free. May your heart be peaceful and free. So, those are the steps of Meditation Expresso. And um, we only need five minutes to practice this meditation, so it should not be too difficult. Now, what we do together is, let us try to put everything together in a five minutes meditation. Now, we shall put all the five techniques together. And we shall do the technique, one technique in every minute. First, is that we smile to different parts of our body. Second, we stroke our thumb and be mindful of the sensation arising from our thumb. Number three, we synchronize the movement of the thumb with our breath. So our thumb is almost mimicking the movement of the breath and amplifying the sensation. Number four, we send loving kindness to ourselves and finally sending loving kindness to a friend. Let us do this all together. Now, let us smile to the different parts of the body. Close your eyes. Let your eyes smile. Be aware of your forehead. Let your forehead smile. Let your cheeks smile. Let your throat smile. Let the upper part of your body smile, including your internal organs, your lungs, your heart, your liver, your spleen, your pancreas, your kidneys, your stomach and intestines. And moving lower down, to the lower part of your body, let the lower part of your body smile. Now, we will move on to the second technique of stroking the thumb and being mindful of the sensation. We do it right now.
Now we will synchronize our breathing with our breathing, with the movements of the thumb, synchronize with your breathing. Now we send love and kindness to ourselves. You say, may my heart be peaceful and free. Listen to your heart as you make this wish. May my heart be peaceful and free. And now you think of a good friend. Making the wish from your heart, you say, my friend, may your heart be peaceful and free. All right, so that's five minutes of meditation espresso. I hope your meditation has been beautiful. So you see, it is not so difficult to meditate, and surely we will have five minutes in a day that we can set aside to do meditation. Now, in this meditation, we have the meditation of the breath, as well as meditation of loving kindness. And these are two important techniques, two very powerful techniques in meditation. And later on, it might be possible to extend this meditation to a longer duration. Now, I must ask you to meditate on a continuous basis. You see, if you were just to do meditation just today, and tomorrow you don't do meditation, uh, the momentum is broken. For you to, de uh, to derive some benefit from meditation, uh, you will get uh, joy and happiness from your heart. It is um, keeping up the momentum of the practice. As an analogy, I could say, like if you want to cycle a bicycle, if you were just to push your leg on a pedal only once, it is impossible. You cannot cycle the bicycle that way. You need to keep cycling, keep pedaling the bicycle, and only then are you able to ride a bicycle and be able to enjoy the scenery. So the practice of meditation is exactly like that, right? So I hope that you will uh, put this practice uh, into your daily life, part, put it as part of your daily life. Choose a suitable time when you think you can meditate. For some people, it's in the early morning. Some other people could be other parts of the day. Yeah? So you just choose your time and practice uh, meditation espresso. Let me wish you 
good health, joy and happiness, and may your life be filled with love and light.